everything's fine, just go home. <laughs> Need some more building. Some building in my in my town hall. Wonderful. So now we can get all the minions to return to the town hall. We need to build a workshop before we can uh, upgrade some more. But that's fine. That's on the docket. Here you can choose further path of your nation. Settle points are gained by upgrading the town. Note that you can only get three settle points. Ooh. Menus with extra buildings that are opened by buying technologies from other nations. This possibility becomes unlocked after researching the technology. What the fuck is it? It's like a wagon. Do you move? Is that what I'm to understand? Well, let's pick a path for our nation. Allows you to fit out expeditions, allows you to hunt rabbits, increases rate action radius of wells. I guess they all sound good. I don't really want to do expeditions though because probably somebody's going to end up dying from those. Rabbits? How much extra food can rabbits provide? Actually, it's probably pretty good. But, um, I think action radius of wells. Then I don't need to fill up my fucking town with wells. That'll do just fine. And then I can build catapults as well. That's gonna be super cool. Hey! Hey! Everything's growing! Everything's looking awesome! Super job! Alright. Somebody cut down this fucking tree. We got... We got more work to do. There's always more work to do, son. Tavern allows you to brew beer. Hospital allows you to heal your minions. Yeah, we need a hospital. But it's too fucking big to go basically anywhere. So fuck that for now. <laughs> Sorry guys, you just gotta suffer. Suffer a little bit longer. Hmm. I need a workshop. Workshop, 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 workshop. Where can I fit this fucking thing? I just don't know. Where's it got to go? Oh, there's there's some space way over here. So there you go. <laughs> you want to get to the workshop? Fucking hustle your ass. Hustle your ass on down to the workshop, boy. There you go. Seems like everybody's doing a good job collecting trees and whatnot. But that lady's still sick. I didn't do a good job protecting my lady. That poor lady. Oh god! She's gonna be the first casualty. And I don't have the, the Lich King on my side. So that's sad. Let's see who, who comes to build this building. Come along! Let us work through the night! Huzzah! I'm just amazed by how much better this game looks. I mean, it was okay before. It was passable. But now it's, yeah, breathtaking. I'm, I'm really just completely shocked at how uh, aesthetic changes like that can make me give a new look to a new look at an old game. There he goes. We're gonna build up that workshop. Do 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 do. All right. Upgrade the blacksmith to so close. Sure, do that. We got plenty of fucking goods and whatnot. Hey, torches needed to repel wolves. We've got some uh, some supplies to make soap. Flax is the main material for making cloth. You could make a lot of bats. Everybody's gonna need a bat at some point. Horn inspires soldiers in battle, increasing their damage. Hmm. Hmm. Fascinating. Sir, it's me again. Uh, I forgot to tell you about diplomacy. As you may have noticed, we're not alone in this world, and we can communicate with other nations. For example, the ambassador of the Kingdom of the East complained of an acute shortage of wood and offered military aid in exchange for such a trade, while the Nords immediately threatened us, and even promised to come for the tribute by threatening war. Um, well fuck those guys. <laughs> you can respond with them by- 
You can respond to them with aggression or make concessions like a wise diplomat by floating a pen and not a sword. I've also heard that on the island far from here there's precious and durable ore which we can make the best equipment. Hmm. Oh god. Oh, Jesus. Those aren't skeletons at all. W where are those things coming from? From the far island, I guess. Hmm. It's not that far from my kingdom, to be quite honest. But it's far enough that we ain't gotta worry about that shit yet. <laughs> Let him come down here. I'll fuck him up, bro. I'll f I'll fuck him up. I'll fuck him up. Alright. What do we got here? Oh, oh, oh. Here's some skeletons. Knew that shit was coming. Where's my hero? Hero! Hero! Come on, come on. You gotta come on down this way. Come on down this here way. Oh, God. They're destroying my building! No! How could this happen? Fuck. God damn it. That sucks. I hate. Everything's gone terribly, all of a sudden. <laughs> Am I gonna have to learn how to play this fucking game again? Oh god! Resurrect your minion. Oh, Jesus. Shoot them! Yeah! Look at him go! Boom, motherfucker! Uh, eat shit, son! There's another one. Go get the other one! Think it's over? It's not over! Dead! Dead! Alright. <sighs> now kill that deer. <laughs> His bloodlust cannot be quenched! We are under attack, I think. No shit! I should probably uh, resurrect this guy. The legends were true! With the power of the glove, we're able to resurrect the dead now. <laughs> Necronomicon. Yeah, that sounds like a great idea. What could possibly go wrong? Um, where's my fucking workshop? Oh, that's right. It got obliterated. Build another one! God damn it. Everything's gone terrible. No, not you. I'm trying to get this guy to, to do some shit for me. Any free minions? We got two free minions. Play this. There you go. Very nice. Upgrade it to sew clothes. It's a shame that we have to do that again, because it got destroyed. It got destroyed super fucking quick, too. That's not cool. Really not cool, is all I'm gonna say about that. Mmm, everybody's standing around doing nothing? That's great. Oh, here's another dead minion. Does she look alive to you? She's got hair covering one of her eyes, so she got kind of that zombie look. But that's okay. Oh my god. People are starving. We need to make more foods. Oh god. I am gonna have to learn how to play this entire game again. The mechanics are exactly the same. What the fuck? The only thing that uh, is different is things are a little slower now. You have build gates here to defend from your enemies. That would probably be a really good idea. Upgrade the gates. Upgrade the town hall to upgrade the gates again. Mmm, I'll think about it. <laughs> I'll give it some serious consideration. For you. For you. Alright. There. There we go. Everything seems wonderful now. Our town's just having a great time. Maybe this field's not growing because there's no well next to it. What the fuck? Is there somebody in that bush? What are you doing, creepy bush? What is anything anymore? Hmm. We need another well. Boom. 
There we go. I don't know how far apart they can be spaced. But that seems like a good distance, doesn't it? People get tired. They're like, I don't want to fucking walk all the way over there for water. I'll just die. <laughs> I'll just die, that's fine. Kill this fucking deer. We'll get some more food. By killing deers. Eat delicious meat. Oh my god, he hit my hero. How evil of him. Not cool. Not cool, bro. Should probably make some stuff from the workshop. Let's do four bats. We could do a couple of bows. It's gonna be real nice. Hmm. I don't necessarily want to make cloth quite yet. That's not the thing to do. Yes, my lord. Yes, my lord. Uh, you want a bat? Anybody want a bat? I gotta wait for it to get made? It took the ingredients immediately. I assumed everything would be okay. Oh, but that chick isn't sick anymore. So that's good. Hooray! There's uh, some modicum of success. I did a thing. I did a thing okay. I'll go upgrade this house. We can fit more citizens. Hooray! How many citizens do we possibly need? Uh, mm, I don't know. How many Nords are coming? <laughs> there, therein lies the question. Yes, yes. Indeed. Hmm. People need some jobs. That's what you fucking people need. Our gatherers can't find any berry bushes nearby. Oh, isn't that sad? There, how's that? Now go kill something. I still don't have any any weapons or anything to equip. I was what the fuck? You guys, are you not making the the things I asked you to make in the workshop? It looks like that guy's working pretty hard. Maybe I'm just a fucking sucker though. Maybe I don't know anything. <laughs> What the hell? What the hell, guys? C come on! Oh! You turn it on, you're like, okay, make this now. I see. Duh. <laughs> oh, there's a little bit more to figure out for this game now. I can't really remember how it worked before, anyways. Oh well, whatever. I got it working now. I got everything going. It's all good. Mostly. Mostly. Are you gonna kill some lady? There you go. Here's a bat. Beat that fucking pig to death with a bat. That'll make me feel good. Kill him. Kill him dead. Good job. Ugh. Oh god. She's getting gangbanged. Getting gangbanged by animals. Animal gangbang. Usually have to pay extra for this. It's a super donkey show in Tijuana. With a boar and a stag. And no donkey. Whoa. I thought she was gonna kill the pig. She ended up killing the fucking... The majestic deer. The rat with antlers. <laughs> oh well, whatever. Hmm, what else could we build for my lovely townies? My lord, they say there lives a necromancer to the west from here. Um, you want to go visit the necromancer? Is that what you're telling me? Find seeds in order to grow these crops. Meh. No do. Here, we'll grow pumpkins. Pumpkins and pumpkins, because pumpkins say that they provide a lot of food. Which may or may not be true. Oh, this lady's still sick, is she not? Hmm. She's looking pretty sick to me. Dang. And now this fucking pig is pissed off. What are you doing, bro? 
What, what are you mad for? Just go home. Everything's fine, just go home. <clears throat> this is where the people live, okay? You don't even want to come in here, I promise. They're gonna fucking eat you. They're gonna eat you, dude. Our people are under attack. Oh god. <laughs> Drop underground. Sure, sure. Yeah, look at this hero. Hero of heroes. Uh. Feel my wrath. Fucking dead. Sucko. How you like that, bitch? Your people eat nothing. Change the ration. Oh god. Come on. Higher rations. Everything's gonna be fine, people. Just hang up, hang in there, and everything's gonna be fine, probably. God, we're so fucked. <laughs> Let's make some soap. Somebody make some soap. Is the engineer making soap? Don't trust that guy to make soap. There's gonna be metal shavings in there that will literally, quite literally, rip your nipples off. <laughs> probably not rip your nipples off. But definitely slit your nipples open. <laughs> and nobody likes that. Chafe nipples. Ooh. Ooh. My. We need more copper to upgrade. Hmm. And it seems this fellow down in the mine is... He's done. He either quit his job or... Or what? I don't know. Where's he gone? Somebody somebody just quit their job in the mine. What the fuck? You think that's acceptable? Here. Oh, I, I can't drag and drop him. But you, you, you go into the mine, Geraldus. I know you were a logger, but you have no experience chopping wood. So down you go. Down into the depths. And I'll probably end up getting a lot of stone, but I'll probably end up with a lot of ores as well. Which is really nice. Everybody likes ores. You guys, you just, you just chilling out? You just having a good time? Make a baby. <laughs> Do something useful! Make a baby! The Nord Ambassador is coming. Oh god. This fucking asshole. Let me tell you something about this fucking asshole. Hmm. Let's go. Time's moving faster. I ain't scared of that Nord ambassador. Let him come down here. What's he gonna say? We want some lingonberry tea or some shit, and I'm gonna be like, bitch, this ain't Ikea. Get out of here with your fucking Swedish meatball eating ass. <laughs> And then, you know, everybody's like, hey, Dayton, Swedish meatballs are pretty good, though. And I'm like, yeah, that's true. That's true. Let's all have some Swedish meatballs. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, this shit's so delicious. How can you say no? Why would anybody say no? Somebody dig up these fucking berry bushes. Let's have some delicious food. How about... So nobody dies. Wouldn't that be wonderful? I'm running low on soap, too. Can we just get this fucking soap going? There we go. Produce more soap. Our gatherers can't find any berry bushes nearby. You guys are fucking blind. It's a... it's a bush. With the red shit hanging off of it. And then you pick the red shit off of it and we all eat it. It's a very simple concept. Let's make some more bats. That's what we need. Heh heh heh. Everybody's gonna get a bat. And then we'll have one extra. So as the, soon as the babies are born, you just thrust a bat into their hands. You're like, here you go. Beat the shit out of a Nord. <laughs> huh. And really, I like the Nords. 
Alright, we all decided to take tribute from all tribes we know, so give me 12 wood and 10 stone, or die. Hmm, 12 wood, 10 stone. That's, that's not a bad deal. Here it is, don't kill us. Very good. My lord, although Nords don't trust us now, I believe they could become useful allies one day. It's either up to you to try and please them or fight them off. Quests to improve relations with Nords are available in the diplomacy menu now. Oh, wonderful. I always wanted to kiss the ass of an asshole. It's like assholeception. Whoa. For now, his, his price is cheap enough. I shall placate him for now. Just until we get stronger. And then I'm gonna fuck him up. I'm gonna fuck him up so hard, dude. Mill allows you to grind flour. Bakery allows you to bake bread. Yeah, let's, let's get some people a job. There we go. Flour can be used to produce bread in the bakery. That, that's what I said. That was the, the whole plan of what I was doing here. Thank you so much for your helpful, helpful hints, which I'm pretty sure I said to turn off anyways. Fucking dick bag. <laughs> bag of dicks. Somebody's coming to build this thing, right? Yeah, the sick lady. <laughs> ah, take your time. Don't worry, the sick lady's coming. She's gonna be over here in no time at all. I wonder if some more skeletons are coming. Please don't let any more skeletons be, be coming over here because I don't like it. Oh, they knocked down my fucking gates? Bro. Not cool. That's how they got in so quick. And I like how they're all coming from the left. I think Nords come from the right. That's the deal. If I'm remembering it correctly. Now I've got a bunch of rubies too. I can deck somebody out. Get my bling bling. I got my bling bling baby. Uh oh. There's some fighting going on. We're under attack. Destroy them! Oh, there are a lot more than there were. This could be ugly. Destroy them! Kill them, please! Oh god. It's not good. Oh my. Dead. My hero's fucking dead. Well. This, this has gone foul. This has gone foul extremely quickly. Who'd have thunk it? Where are all my people? Should have built some barracks. Should have trained some soldiers. <laughs> my people were just poor farmers. All they had was a wood club to defend themselves. And they didn't even try to defend themselves. They're just like, eh. There's skeletons walking around. Look at those guys. So I paid to defend myself from the Nords, and for what? Because a fucking band of skeletons just walked into the town and they're like, Oh, uh, yeah, we killed everybody. Everybody fucking died. <laughs> what a fail. Fantastic fails. God damn. That ain't good. Are we gonna win? No. <laughs> There's too many of them. Oh well. This has been another expedition into Life is Hard. Uh, maybe next time, when I come back around, I won't be so taken aback and shocked by the graphics. And uh, I can figure out what I did right in the last times and maybe do that in, in the future times that we do this. <laughs> really, it's a fucking fantastic game. I'm super, super excited to see it uh, developing the way that it is. I still don't think it's in full release, which is interesting. It's been in uh, early access for quite a long time. And if it is in full release, then um, it's still pretty acceptable. I mean, they've got faction relationships and all this kind of cool stuff. So if it looks like a game that you'd enjoy, I definitely suggest going to check it out on Steam. The link is in the description. Uh, my town hall is going to fall any second. So that's that's always a sad thing. 
And this guy's just gonna smoke. Smoke a cigar. Because what else is life worth, huh? Fuck everything, huh? Ah, <laughs> uh, you didn't manage to keep your throne. The peasants are dead and the village is burnt. Even your jester would cope better. God damn. I really do suck at this game. <laughs> Not that much has changed, honestly. Everything's changed, but nothing's changed. <laughs> Anyways, friends, I still hope that you've enjoyed. I've been Brandon Dayton, friends, your humble narrator. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to like, comment, and or subscribe. If you did enjoy the episode and would like to see some more of this content, um, I'm thinking about doing another episode just because that was, that was a really sad show that I gave just now. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll see about it. Uh, I'll roll it around in the old noodle, and we'll, we'll see what happens. Anyways, friends, I hope to see you in the next one, whatever that may be. And until then, friends, bye bye One, two, three, four, goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friends.